Hey, what's up? My name is Ali Santana, and I am a multidisciplinary artist and an educator. Uh, today, I want to talk about some techniques that I use in my practice to stay creative. Uh, so I really love working with the moving image, and I create short films, music videos, performances, um, basically anything I'm, I'm interested in. And I love combining the moving image with a sound to tell stories. Uh, so today I want to talk about film collage. Film collage is a technique that I use uh, to tell abstract stories, but more so a way to express myself or maybe the way I'm feeling at a particular moment. And uh, film collage can go by many other different names. Some people call it a montage. Some people call it uh, a mashup. Other people call it like found footage films. Uh, but basically, it, it just kind of expands on the idea of a traditional collage where you would mix and match uh, cutouts from magazines or books to tell a story. In this case, we'll be cutting out moving images um, from pre-existing sources to tell new abstract stories. Uh, and so I want to go over the, the software that I'm using to do that and some technique and some brief philosophy about how to go about doing these things. Um, so mainly, this is kind of like a stream of consciousness uh, exercise. Uh, it can be totally improvisational, and I really want to focus, or maybe not focus, on making things perfect. So let's start off with a mindfulness exercise. And for me, mindfulness is really just the act of paying attention. So what I like to do is I like to sit still in a comfortable position, close my eyes, and basically meditate for 10 minutes or so and just kind of let the, the thoughts flow um, and I don't really want to guide my thoughts in any way I just want to let anything that comes to mind just flow by and then at the end of that 10 minutes uh, I write down all of the keywords all of the things that I thought about and so this will be important for later uh, after we finish our mindfulness exercise we're gonna write down all the keywords and then do a search for those keywords uh, on the internet to try to find videos that relate to the things that we thought about. And this is the basis for just starting a project rather than overthinking an idea or you know, a project that we might have in mind. This is just a way to start fresh with new ideas and uh, see what we get. 